The giant squid is a creature that has gone from myth and legend to fact. The old sea tales of krakens and sailors being dragged to the bottom of the ocean were once scoffed at, but now we know they were probably true. The giant squid still remains enigmatic, the behemoth rarely being seen, and science still has a lot to learn about these highly intelligent super predators. This knowledge improves little by little each time there is a sighting or the discovery of a dead animal. This is something that has just occurred with divers finding an enormous squid on a New Zealand beach. Welcome to IF, videos on mystery and history. Hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to never miss a video again. The recent finding of this underwater giant may help scientists gain more understanding of the underwater eight-legged monster. Found on Saturday 25th of August by spear fishermen on the Wellington beach in New Zealand, the pictures show how these men are dwarfed by the cephalopod. At a length of 13 feet or 4.2 meters, this is a large animal, but at its biggest it is said that these creatures could grow as large as 16 feet. This creature is said to be a smaller Arcatuthus ducks, not the beast which most likely inspired the legends of the kraken, the colossal squid. This large slab of calamari would have been made to look small if it had been a colossal squid as they can break 30 feet in size. This information is highly speculative as gathering any kind of data on these animals is notoriously difficult. Most of what we do know has been gleaned from accidental captures and specimens washing ashore. So with these legends of the deadly kraken attacking boats, sailors and creatures as large as whales, do we see these behaviors playing out in the real world with these two species of giants? The short answer is yes. And here are three tales of frightening squid attacks they may well have you staying out of the water. In this clip we can see a monstrous squid attacking a diver in the ocean depths. We can see this diver is just taking footage of an elusive creature when from the murky depths a squid decides to go on the attack. Wrapping the diver in its tentacles the man is almost powerless to fight back. This smaller species of squid like other large squid has hooks running along each of its tentacles, these grabbing the diver with ferocious strength. We can see the animal attempting to pull the man towards its mouth, a beak-like apparatus that would have easily torn through the man and crushed his bones, probably being able to tear the man limb from limb. This sounds just like the old sea tales to me. Luckily the diver manages to break free and heads for the surface with no serious injuries thankfully. Incredibly it's not the first time this elusive sea monster has attacked visitors to their domain. Scott Castle, diver and filmmaker was also attacked by the angry eight armed underwater terror. He tells of how the creature dragged him underwater at ridiculous speed, breaking his wrist and dislocating his shoulder. If attacking a diver is not close enough to the legends of the kraken and its attacks on sailing ships of old, how about an attack on a submarine? Two Greenpeace workers were using a submersible in one of their projects. This is when a giant Humboldt squid decided to attack them, spraying ink as it swarmed the small submarine containing the two people. The Humboldt squid may not be the size of the cephalopods we have already mentioned, but they more than make up for the size difference with aggressiveness that is legendary. It's even earned them the nickname Red Devils. The bright red color coming from their ability to manipulate and change the shades and color of their skin. This is thought to be a method of communication, but it also adds to the terror when they are attacking. Flashing through an array of colors and back to a bright red, they become a kaleidoscope of terror. These tentacled menaces have killed, 
Reports coming out of Mexico document how a pack of squid capsized a fishing vessel and attacked the fishermen in a gruesome spectacle witnessed by many from the beach. One of these witnesses talks about seeing bodies washing ashore. He said these unlucky souls were black and blue all over and covered in circular lesions from the squid suckers. One survivor washed up with the bodies. This unfortunate man was almost unrecognizable. Biologists commented on this horrific incident, saying they think that the attack was from a coordinated group of female squid. This attack was so bad it had the local government creating a cordoned off area of the sea. This so no one else would fall victim to the locally known Diablos Rojos. One scary fact of this incident is that it is likely to happen again. Dwindling fish stocks will put man and beast at odds in the future. These giant squids will make an unmatchable adversary for anyone who takes to the water with them. Their size, the gang mentality, eight strong flexible arms and two longer tentacles with large pads to grab prey, all covered in suction cups lined with small teeth. Cardio would not be an issue for them, they have three hearts. Eyes the size of soccer balls mean they can easily spot anyone even in the darkest ocean waters. All of this would be enough to keep me out of the water. How about you? Would you like to see this squid up close? Do you think the stories of the Kraken pulling down whole ships could be true? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoy what we do here on the channel, please hit that subscribe button, like and share. You can find us across social media by searching We Are If. Thanks so much for watching, see you next time.